here we go. I've located the target. It's in the Iwatodai Station Plaza. Just out in the open, chilling. This will be the tenth shadow. Only a few left. Let's just worry about them one at a time. The last few have been like pretty. If they hidden. actually appear one at a time, we don't need two at once again. Yukari chan how did you know? Oh, <laughs> I sense two of them. Well, rip. What? Seriously? Me and my big mouth. So that would mean the final one is just Where on its own. Be? I was expecting the final one to be a two part. Notified me that he'll be joining us later. Oh god, you I hope didn't he. Say why though? I hope he joins us in time for the actual fight because Figures. I've He's leveled him. Played by his own rules. Uh oh, I'm gonna be very sad if Shinji is not available for the actual fight because then I guess I'm taking. Who would be the next highest? Mitsuru, maybe. But I had, you know, I ran with him through the whole of Tartarus, so he was higher level than anyone. Any other option? Um, should we wait a little longer? Well, I'm sure it's fine. He said he's coming later, right? Yeah, that's already better than a certain someone who didn't show last time. Hey, come on, that wasn't my fault. Don't worry, I'm totally ready to go this time. See? Wait, Amada Kun isn't here either. Oh hey, God! Hey, go get him. That'll be your punishment for last time. Ken, don't tell me you're trying punishment. to do whatever well, you had planned now. Well, I guess it is a kid's bedtime. Surely Ken hasn't picked a fucking full moon day. All right, we've got two targets to this time. Let's do whatever it is he was we'll planning with Shinji. We'll decide on our team formation once we get there. Let's go. Oh, this auto. is the route we always take to school. We've got to protect it. It's almost like they're waiting for us. By the way, where's Amada? Uh, he wasn't in his room, so who knows? Shinji's late, too. Oh, man. Um, we should probably hurry. I think they're about to make their move. Then we have no choice. Let's organize a team it. from the members we have here. Once we're set, we'll move in. God damn it. Well, that is incredibly unfortunate. Who is... Okay, so Makoto 50, Yukari 50, and I guess 49. Oh, man. Mitsuru's the next best at 43. Six levels behind. But I guess he'll have to do, huh? Oh, that's such a bummer. That is such a bummer. If I'd have known that, then I wouldn't have fucking spent... I mean, I did really like having Shinji in the team. He was very good for Tartarus, but it means that the rest of them are not up to par. But I guess it has to be Mitsuru in the other slot then. Uh, how is Mitsuru doing for defense and stuff? Is there anything better we can give her? Doesn't look like it. We can give her the 55, although she has... Is 6... I, don't, I think the 50 HP is better probably for her. We'll probably still be fine. I, I would imagine we'll still be fine. Let's pop a save. She's only 6 levels behind. Like, it's not the worst thing in the world. Uh, so, Yukari, you're up hey. first. God damn it. Mm. <laughs> she was already in the party. <laughs> Let's go. What do the other people have to say? Hey, so about Shinji. Never mind, this is no time to get distracted. Okay. Are they all just gonna have like not Excuse much to me. say? What's the hold up? Okay, they don't they don't have a ton to say. Hmm. We don't have the luxury to fuss over those who aren't even present. Concentrate on the enemy in front of us. Cool, cool. Um right, I believe that is yes. everyone. Are you ready? Let's do it. Please be careful out there. Standing by to provide support. Be careful out there. Howdy. Well, that one looks tiny. Should I be more scared of the tiny one, do you think? Uh, what? The fortune arcana... Is gone? The strength Arcana 
must have done something. Right. <laughs> okay. There's no way to attack it now. You'll have to defeat the strength arcana first. Well, there's my decision made for me, I guess, sure. What to do? Uh what do we want to begin with? I'll go with. Let's begin with light damage. Oh, that's a lot of health. That's a lot of health. Okay, uh Raise Party's attack. This is my kill. Lower their accuracy and evasion. I'll hit them where it hurts. Lower their defense. What the hell is Julius Wondo? Whoa! Whoa! Okay. Wow, that's a lot of damage. Uh, fortune roulette, huh? I have a feeling like we're about to lose Mitsuru. Attack for all allies and enemies increase. Oh, okay. That roulette. It looks like wherever it stops, it will activate a different effect. Red hurts and blue helps. Allies and enemies. It doesn't discriminate. Hmm. Okay. Well, at least it's buffing where us it as well. Is random. And I can't predict it. But either way, be careful. And I can negate their it? buffs. Uh, well, we can analyze now, so that's good. Oh, well, I mean, maybe it's a good thing that Shinji wasn't here. Because <laughs> uh, that's not great. I guess is feeling very unfortunate right about now. Okay, well... So we just want our highest powered uh, magic, which I believe we have a 50, don't we? Don't we have a 50 magic? Oh, 54 magic here, okay. There's no shot that fucking insta-kills work on bosses, right? So let's just go with the old classic Bufu Dine, shall we? <laughs> 251, and it does like no damage. <laughs> oh god. Summoning. Um, nullify stat debuffs for all allies. No, we need nullify stat buffs for all enemies. Is it only Makoto that has that? It might only be Makoto that has that. Um, let's raise party defense. We raised attack. We didn't raise defense. We definitely need a fat heal. Mitsuru is not back to full, but everyone else is, so hopefully that'll be fine. Uh, right. I mean, it's gonna block it right, but let's just try. I, I don't know why I keep trying, because bosses block this stuff every single time. But like, what if there's one time when they don't, you know? What if there's one time when the boss does not block? Okay, um, nullify stat buffs to all foes, yeah. Go away. Alright, well, unfortunately, I guess we will have to do this, which you resist, but it's all we have. Wow, that's unfortunate. That is no damage at all, in fact. Uh, let's just keep us topped up. Seeing as Mitsuru came very close to death in a single turn, I don't like us not being at full health. I'll hit them where it hurts. Go for it. I've got the letter. Crit rate up. No, thank you. Oh, 
300. Ow! Oh my god! That almost one shots me! No effect? The crit rate up is not a thing we can remove? Ah, fuck. I did not think we would not be able to remove crit right now. I think I can use it now. Ready for action. If we use it now, it's just gonna full heal us. Is that worth, or should we full heal from Yukari? Hmm. If we use hers to full heal, if we use Fuka's to full heal, then Yukari can use her turn using her Theogy, which is probably better. So let's let's get a full heal off of Fuka. Yes. Oh, never mind. She didn't full heal us. Is that not an option? I thought I thought she had a full HP, a full SP, or a stat buff thing. And I thought it would depend on what your health is. And considering we're all super low, I figured that she would use her uh, use her heal. But maybe she doesn't have that as an option. It heals us most of the way. What's the plan here? It do be healing us most of the way. Oh god, this is a painful one. Okay, that wasn't so bad that time. However, if this lands on 300 again, we literally just lose instantly. That is actually terrifying. If it lands on the 300 again, we just instantly lose the game. Okay. Defense for all allies and enemies increased. Well, no, there's no point doing that while they have defense increased, so let's just get rid of the defense increase then. Wait, no effect? What? But the defense is increased. What? What do you mean? I don't understand. Why can I not use this? They literally just increase their defense. Unless I... Had I... Okay, maybe I'd def defense downed them, so by getting it raised, it just put them to normal. Is that what happened? That must be what happened, right. Alright, let's, uh... Let's do this. Fifty. Huge damage there. <laughs> uh, let's get another heal going. We need to constantly be topped off. The threat of the threat of the three hundred damage is so strong. It is a terrifying threat. Uh, wait, it says its defense is still down. Or did the thing... Did it... Did I misread it? Was it not that it was buffing our defense? Was it that, that it was fucking over everyone's hurt. defense? Was that it? That might have been it. I may have just misread. And I thought it was a buff and it was a debuff. I love you, Mitsuru. Gigantic fist. Oh, get fucked. Damage inflicted. No reaction. What to do? Okay. Uh, Boofu dying again then? We're getting there. We're working through the health bar. Slowly but surely. Oh, we actually got a crit. Okay, uh, we are in a position where we can use the Theurgy now. Nice. Everyone's already full health. 
It's going to come close to killing it. I don't think it will, but it'll be close. Yeah, we are very close. Uh, Mitsuru's not going to be enough to finish it off, is she? It's not quite enough. Oh no! Tell a lie. I'm sorry I ever doubted you, Mitsuru. My queen. Now I'm afraid your pet dog is about to get I can detect Fortune's presence again. Your attack should land now. No reaction. I'll go with. Okay, we haven't found out anything. Oh wait, we can just complete. Oh! Oh my god. The dog is a little bitch. The dog's gonna fucking fall over to punches and electricity. What to do? Adios. Oh yeah, this motherfucker's done. Well, it was the hardest fight since the lovers, purely because of the risk of instant death from the 300 and the massive health bar on that main boss. But uh, definitely uh, not particularly hard overall. It drains wind, so I guess we just punch. <laughs> Uh, does it drain ice as well? It does drain ice as well, so... There's nothing you can do to scare me now, dog. You are done next turn. Adios, amigo. Oh. Amazing. 726, alright. Whoa, what the fuck? Why was that the weakest all-out attack damage I've ever seen in my entire life? Oh god, it's a scripted thing. There's a chance we can just instantly lose? Is that what it's saying? You're joking, right? Nothing happened? Okay. That had to be scripted. There's no way we just fucking randomly landed on the death symbol. Repeat. Yeah, get off the field. Well, that is a cheeky amount of SP. That is a very cheeky amount of SP. Was that supposed to do something and we just got it too low? And so before it could happen, the dog was already dead or what? Neuro slash for Mitsuru. Medium slash to all foes. Low chance of confuse. Do I care about that? On a, you have only 30 strength. I don't think I care about that. You're not... You're not really... I mean, the confuse chance is nice, I guess, but... I guess it might be nice to have something for when the enemy isn't uh, weak to... Or isn't like blocks or drains or whatever ice, but we have ice break for that. I don't know. And then it's like there's these things, but they never fucking land. They're blocked every single time that we face a boss. And the only time I need them is against a boss, because against regular enemies, they're not like they're dead before we have even needed these ever so should I just get rid of these I guess what's coming up next freeze boost very nice very well, nice I can support you all even better. escape route return to the entrance of Tartarus cool okay next up Tartarus surge fully reveals the current floor and provides shortcut to the next floor that's 13 entire levels away that is a long time away is that her final one there's no more question marks at the bottom so is that her final upgrade? Good job, everyone. Oh man, it's exhausting dealing with two of them at once. Indeed. The two claiming to be Strega did not interfere this time. Oh yeah. 
It's probably because we have their navigator. They can't outmaneuver us now. Anyway, I'm glad everything went well. Still, Aragaki Senpai never showed, huh? Yeah, what is Ken doing? Too. <laughs> what is Ken doing, man? The chairman doesn't seem to be too concerned. He's already headed home. Yamagishi, do you know yeah, where they are? Yeah, that's because the chairman's sus as fuck. Sorry, I haven't been able to locate them yet. Let's return to the dorm for the time being. Hmm. Akihiko, hmm. are you listening? Today is October 4th, right? Oh, uh, is yeah, this the anniversary? Right. Go on back without me. I'm gonna go look for them. Is this the anniversary of whatever happened with Wait, senpai. I wonder Shinji what's up. and Ken's, Akihiko. I assume, parents? I don't think we've had it confirmed, but it, I assume it's about Ken's parents. You came, just like we agreed. Ken, are you about to try and kill him? I don't think that's going to go well for you, buddy. <clears throat> Do you know why I called you here? You probably have an idea, since you skipped the operation for it. Two years ago today, on October 4th, that was the day my mom died here. Okay, it is his mom. They I was right it about it being a parent. Car accident. But and it, it was wasn't. something that they Shinji caused thing. accidentally, right? I saw my mom get From killed. what we overheard. You murdered her! Uh. Since then, not one good thing has happened. Just being alive is torture. And all I get from people is sympathy. No matter where I go. What's the I mean, point of living like this? Sympathy can be nice. <laughs> I've even thought about killing myself. Jesus, but you're like ten. I wouldn't be able to face mom like that. That is fucking That's dark why for a ten-year-old. Vowed to live until I found her killer. You. I once heard you say you wanted to forget what you did on that day. So, when I realized it was a full moon today, I knew I had to confront you. They did say it was an accident, right? I'm pretty sure. I'd have to go and review that cutscene where Ken was overhearing Shinji and uh, Akihiko. But I'm pretty sure they did say that, like, whatever happened wasn't an intentional thing, right? Today, Mom is with me. I'll make you remember what you did to her. I'm gonna kill you! <sighs> do it. Whoa. <laughs> no. <laughs> Do not, in fact, oh. do it. No one else is back yet? Man, I wonder why Sonata-san was acting so weird. Something about the date. What's so special about October 4th? October 4th? That's right. I was so focused on the operation that I didn't realize it. Today is the anniversary of the day Amada's mother was killed. She was killed? Yamagishi, I need you to locate Aragaki and Amada immediately. There's a good chance they'll be together. Akihiko must have already realized it. Uh, I'm on it. Uh, Come on, Fuka. What's going on? Public records say that Amada's mother was killed in an accident. But in truth, we were the ones responsible for her death. What? It happened two years ago, when we were hunting down a shadow that appeared in the city. Okay, Aragaki give me the had deets. only just awakened his persona, and he lost control of it for a moment. Oh. We'd been so focused on the shadow, we hadn't accounted for any civilians in the area. Unfortunately, that's why he's been taking the suppressors. There was one casualty. It was Amada's mother. No way! Are you kidding me? Wait, so to Amada Kun, Aragaki Senpai is. I should have considered this when Amada volunteered to join us. It's possible that he... Yeah, I mean, considering I that... They're at Tatsumi Port Island! Considering that um, Shinji and Akihiko were discussing this fact out in public, loud enough to be overheard, and not even, like, checking around to make sure that they weren't being overheard, or whatever, like, why would, why would they do that? Why would they do that when it's something that major as the actual death of a person? They were just chatting about it, you know? Feels like maybe you should have had that conversation in private. They're together, and 
Anything where Ken wouldn't have rocked up and been like, yo, you did what now? Is it Akihiko? Wait, this is... No, it's Striga! Oh, God, what now? Hey, isn't that a problem? Yeah, a little bit. This couldn't be worse. Senpai! Come on, we gotta follow her. Oh, God, right. what's Striga getting involved gonna do? Do it. I won't stop you. You're right. I just wanted to forget. That's why I left everyone behind. And tried to use the drugs to suppress my power. But nothing I did could erase the memory. No it's matter like what fault, I do, you, man. I always end up back here. <sighs> it's my fault. This is what I deserve. But I gotta give you a warning. A warning? You take my life, and you're gonna end up just like me. Damn, and I just realized, yeah, this is the place that we found him hanging out constantly, right? We've had multiple scenes with him here. And that is because this is the actual place where it happened. Damn. You better be prepared for that. What? Are you begging for your life? Even if all you have now is hatred. One day you'll regret it. Shut up! That's bullshit! I must say I agree. Oh boy, Takaya's here. <sighs> These are not his sins to bear. That is the nature of revenge. Is it not permissible to kill those who are themselves killers? Uh, that's right. What do you want? Losing one of our own has posed a slight challenge for us, but we cannot simply turn a blind eye to all the trouble you've caused. You bastard. Let's not. Fear not. This life is but a stepping stone. I shall deliver unto you both salvation. Nah. What'd you say? My. Protecting your would-be murderer? Oh, yeah, she's a good fucking person. That's right. Whether or not to this boy's revenge, you are fated to die regardless. What does he mean? You've been taking those suppressants for some time. He did mention this. You don't have much longer. That's bullshit! Listen to your body. The signs have already begun. What are you talking about? You're just going to die? No matter what? Even if I don't do anything? That's not fair! This is all I've been living for! What was even the point then? The cause of death is hardly of importance. Besides, the breath of life is faint in you as well, child. You were planning to join him once the deed was done, were you not? Yeah, that's why Ken was telling us to look after his hamster and stuff. God damn, what? man, this is dark. What? This may be a bit ill-timed, but no matter. It matters not whose life I take first. You're both destined to perish anyway. Shut the fuck up! Tell him. No! No! Now then, with what life you have left, answer me this. There is a navigator in your rank similar to Chidori, is there not? Don't You've fucking tell him. You've been killing the shadows we wish to protect with startling efficiency before we can even arrive. Tell me. Which one of you is it? Surely you're not going to give up that info. If you don't expedite your answer, then this will hurt you more than it hurts me. Come on, Shinji. You got this, man. <laughs> What's wrong? Cat got your tongue. Or are you ready to talk? <laughs> yeah. That's my yes. boy. No one. Hmm. Wait! It's me. 
Oh, shit. Really now? Oh, shit. It's the truth. That's the Ken only with reason the fucking they let me play. join. Even though I'm a kid. Holy shit, my respect for Ken just like quadrupled. Quiet. I wasn't talking to you. It doesn't matter now. I'll never have my revenge. I don't have any reason to live. What's the point in fighting anymore? I see. So, you accept salvation. What a beautiful end to your life. Very well. You shall go first. Akihiko, can you, Rest like, turn up peacefully. at the moment, right? Like, you've been on your way for a while now. <laughs> Cutscene. Oh, shit. Come on, Akihiko. Come on. Mom. <laughs> oh, my... Holy fucking nut! Oh my god. Oh my god, is that a kill shot? Surely not. <laughs> Just what was that for? That looked like a kill shot. What reason could you possibly have to risk your life for this child? Because he's a good fucking person, man. <laughs> Shinji! What? Akihiko gets here at the same time as everyone else? Companions. How very With like a fucking massive head start? Just begun. <laughs> Shinji! <laughs> Hang in there! Aragaki! Senpai! Aragaki san! <laughs> Come on. Yukari, can you do some healer shit? Like. Surely he's not actually dying. It's exactly what you wanted. It's all right. Hold on to that anger. Let it be your strength. You've still got your whole life ahead of you. Don't you, kid? From now on, you're gonna have to live for yourself. Fuck, man. This sounds like a death monologue. You actually gonna die? I can't. Okay. Look after him. I will. Oh man. This is how it should be. Cool. That fucking Aki's voice acting just fucking hit me. <laughs> Seriously? Holy fuck, dude. I can't believe they just did that. They actually just killed him off. After many hard fought battles, our team has suffered our first casualty. A dear friend's life has been claimed in a manner I never could have imagined. That night, no one spoke a word. Then, the next day. Motherfucker, I leveled that motherfucker up in Tartarus! I put all the levels into- oh my god. I can't believe it. Shinji was literally rocketing up my fucking favourite characters list. Ever since he joined the team, he was- He was rising up to like, the top three spots in favourite characters, and then they just kill him off, like, a singular month later? I didn't even get to use him in the boss fight! Oh, man! I actually can't believe they did that. I was not expecting that at all. Like, obviously, the only Persona game I- I don't know- I don't know- I don't, don't tell me, obviously. I don't know what happens in other Persona games. Well, 1 and 2 are kind of different things as far as I know, but I know 3, 4, and 5 are all similar, like, style of game. So I don't know what happens in 4, obviously, haven't played that one yet, but from 5, I was like, there's no way that any main, like, teammate character is going to be killed off, because, uh, you know, <laughs> they don't be doing that, right? 
So I was sitting there like, I mean, there's no way he's actually going to die, right? And then he dies. Fuck me. Well, I was I was a fan of Takaya until now. I kind of I was kind of enjoying Takaya. Fuck Takaya. Hate Takaya. Hope we get to fucking kill Takaya. He just killed best boy. However, I must still go to school today. I think maybe, you know, fucking personal tragedy gets you the day off. Am I crazy? I don't know if I feel like hearing the no happy words can express the sense of loss you feel as a result of this terrible tragedy. Okay, maybe we're not going to get the happy school soundtrack, which is good. I'm I'm stunned that we don't get the day off for a close friend getting fucking murdered. He had a lifetime of opportunity ahead of him. As educators, we are to blame for ignoring his silent calls for help. We tragically lost him to senseless violence before we had a chance to help him realize his true potential. Forgive us. Forgive us for our negligence. The principal continues with his eulogy. <laughs> He just never stops talking. Shut I'd the fuck up. I've heard man. of any Aragaki. Had you? I heard he never came to school. Probably just some punk. Oh, I just want to get home. I gotta study for my mock exam. I'm going hey, to introduce you, you to my most powerful Aragaki persona, is? motherfucker. Wait, you're not even in the same year. No way you'd know him then. Anyways, it's crazy that stuff like this really happens, huh? Shut your fucking mouth. Huh? What the hell's your problem? You are. Shut up. <sighs> huh? What are you getting up for? I said shut the hell up! Oh, fucking tell him, Junpei. Damn it! Just ignore them, Junpei. <laughs> no can do. Hey, have you seen Sonata-senpai today? No. I mean... They were close since, like, fucking... Very early childhood. Not sure when they first met at the orphanage. Not sure how old they were, but I've got to imagine it was very young. And they were close for years and years and years and years and years. And then obviously a bit of a break in the last couple of years, but like... For most of their lives, they've been seemingly inseparable. So I can't imagine he's decided to come to school today. He was absent this morning. I wonder if he'll show up at all. I hope he's okay. He's probably not okay. I'm not okay. Do you have a moment? Oh. Sure. When you get back today, let's meet in the lounge. I think you all know the reason. Right. I don't expect you to have your thoughts in order. I'm not even sure what to do myself. All right. I'll see you then. So it's about Amada, huh? Well, this will be a fun meeting. Yeah. Dude, I can't believe this is happening. My fucking boy. Ah, he's come after everyone else is gone, okay. Hey. At the usual for lunch. I was wondering what ramen tastes like when you skip class. It's surprisingly good. You could have invited me at least once, you know. Come on, say something. Why do you have to be like that? Always going off without saying a word. Put yourself in my shoes for a change. You think it's the other way around? Yeah. You're right. I was always the one running off on my own. I was too obsessed with getting stronger ever since I lost Miki. That's all I've cared about. I thought if I was strong enough, I could protect anyone. 
But I was wrong. And now you're gone too. God, it's like the world is laughing at me. I knew what we were getting into. I knew we were putting our lives on the line. But I was so focused on fighting that I didn't see anything else. It doesn't matter how strong I was. Look what happened! <laughs> Jesus Christ, man. He's making me fucking tear up. I know, Shinji. Crying won't change anything, right? I don't need you to tell me that. In the end, I can't run away from who I am. I've had enough of this. Uh, hello? What? Persona is evolving? The resolution in Sonata's heart has awakened a new persona. Okay. Sonata's persona, Polyduces, has given rise to Caesar. Severe electric damage to one foe with a high chance of shock. Rest easy, Shinji. You just watch from there with me. I've still got a job to do. Isn't that right? God damn, dude. His VA is killing it. Insane work. Had me you fucking all know crying. the reason we're gathered here. We need I'm to just like stunlock with Amata. I've already consulted the chairman. I guess bring him here. Understood. What would I do with Amata? It's my fault. If it was if it was me. Cuz he's like 10, man. Or like at, at most 12 or something. I think he's I think he's like 10. I think he's fucking barely double digits of age. So like I can't blame him for him wanting to kill Shinji. I mean, people much older than that. If that's what they thought had happened, and I mean it kind of was, but obviously it wasn't deliberate. It kind of was Shinji that killed her. Obviously, accidentally, he lost control and you know, he's a good person. But you can totally understand why Ken felt the way he did and why he tried to do what he was trying to do. But at the same time, like, that was fucking dark. He's fucking 10 and he was going to kill himself. He was going to kill Shinji and then kill himself. That's insane. So, like, I don't know if he's, like, mentally able to be part of this group, <laughs> but it's not like... He can, we, it's not like we can take his persona off him or anything, so... I don't know how you'd stop him. You'd just have to, like, lock him in his room or some shit. I don't know. I don't know, man. Can you let him continue to be part of the group after that? I'm not sure if it would be, like, responsible as an adult to allow that. I think he needs therapy. I think he needs fucking... <laughs> he needs friendship and therapy, and probably not to be going out murdering shadows and potentially getting murdered himself, you know? I don't know. Well, let's see how they handle it. I knew it, it was strange when Aragaki-senpai told me he'd be late, but I didn't say anything. If I'd only listened to my intuition, this wouldn't have happened. This isn't on you, dude. That's right. It's not your fault. If there's anyone who should have realized, it's me. I should have been taking things more seriously, too. I knew this wasn't a game, but I never thought it'd end up like this. There's no point dwelling on the past. Shinji's last words were, this is how it should be. He was a hell of a guy. <laughs> he even faced death with a smile. So, from this day forward, I'll face things head on too. This is how yeah. it should be. Huh. Senpai. 
Reporting in. Amada-san is not oh in this room. Oh my god. He's not? Evidence indicates that his window has been pried open. Amada-kun! Wait, Fuka, where are you going? Do you even know where to look? Well, no, but we can't just let him go off on his own, right? You're just gonna run around without a clue? You'll never find him like that. Maybe not, but we have to try! Amada-kun has nowhere else to go. I know exactly how that feels. Let's go look for him. But where do we even look? <laughs> you of all people should understand, Yukari-chan! Fuka! I'm sorry. I, I didn't mean to. Give him some time. Dragging him back won't change how he feels. And we can't protect him forever. Akihiko! It's his choice. He's the only one who can decide how to live his life. We all choose our own paths. <sighs> wow. Wow. Okay. Oh man, fucking wild ride of an emotional roller coaster there. The actual fucking, like, the high of the boss fight, followed by the fucking, like, not believing what was going to happen in that cutscene, and then seeing it, realizing it really was happening. Fucking sadness from that. Akiko's VA just absolutely fucking annihilating me. And now I'm thinking about what's going to happen with Ken, and he's fucking run off. That's some crazy shit, dude. God damn. Well, this game is very good. I don't know if you knew that. I don't know if, I don't know if you guys were aware, choosing to watch Let's Plays of the game. I don't know if you had, a, had an inkling, but I, I think this game is, in fact, very good. <laughs> Fuck me. Jesus. Okay, well, let's leave it there in our classic ending position. Don't worry, guys. Wakatsu PR has a message for us. Limited set meal today. I don't know if I'm in the mood, Wakatsu PR. I don't know if I... Wow. Uh, yeah. Wow. Okay. Well. Let's fucking... Wallow in sadness. 69 hours in. Is it is it bad to make a 69 nice joke after the death of my beloved teammate? Yeah, probably shouldn't do that, huh? God damn it, dude! He was rocketing up the ranks so fast. He was he was top three. He was he was vying for like the top spot even. Man, it's gonna take me a while to get over this. <laughs> it's gonna take me a bit, but uh, we we shall return and continue on and see where the fuck we go from here. And I hope the direction is towards Takaya with gun in hand. Let's fucking. Cowboy showdown that motherfucker and be quicker on the draw or some shit. I don't know, man. Like, I guess we're, we're gonna turn into Ken now. We saw Takaya fucking kill Shinji. But there's no fucking, you know, misinformation. There's no misunderstanding there. It wasn't an accident. Bro just fucking murdered him. Like, we're gonna get his ass. I hope. We shall see. Anyway, thank you very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed, if such an emotion is one you can feel right now. If you did, if you could leave a like and subscribe if you haven't already. Share the videos around, share the playlist around if you can. I would really appreciate that. And I'll see you next time for more Persona 3 Reload. Thanks for watching. See you then.